Okay, so um, here is, I'm using ChatGTP to write this contract with um, the Native Americans. And I said at the beginning to prime the pump, do you know anything, do you know how to write legal contracts? And it says, yes, I'm familiar with legal contract language and structure. However, it's important to note that I'm a machine, not a licensed attorney. And then I say, can you help me get organized before we write the contract? Here's what I'm organized. I need to organize my legal terminology. Will you help me? build a table that organizes the legal terminology. And then it says, sure, I can do something like this, consideration, the contract law, the basis for the law, the subject. And then I keep going and I say, okay, um, can you help me get organized with a table that breaks down the contract into various subjects? My company, A New Energy or A New, is looking to share revenue with the American University in New Mexico called Navajo Technical University or um, NTU. And so then I, um, I go all the way down here and, I, and I, I add all the subjects that we're doing and how we're going to split revenue with the university. And then it, it says, yeah, it creates a table with all the parties, the purpose, the revenue sharing, the equipment, the support services, all this stuff. And then I'm like, OK, let's keep getting organized. Here are the players, Pat Connor with A New Energy, Scott Holliday with Navajo Technical University. And then it, it says, sure, I'll get you organized. The parties involved are Pat and Scott. And it, it writes, you know, how the contract is going to be auto-renewed, severability and clause. And then it keeps going down here. And I say, great. So I would like an example of this contract, of a contract like this. Can you please write a contract with information so I can show it to my lawyer? Because it says, you need to refer to a lawyer. And I'm like, all right, great. Give me an example. And then I hit return here. Watch what happens. So... It may work, it may not, may need me to ask some more questions. It says, sure, here's an example of a contract that incorporates your inf information provided, the contract agreement, and it's writing my contract right now. The contract agreement is entered to this date, signature below, blah, blah, blah. And so now I'm, I'm writing a legal contract with artificial in, in intelligence involved here. So it's got the purpose, um, and it's going through all this stuff, getting me organized to talk to my lawyer. So I think that this is going to um, be a great way to cut costs with these expensive law firms. I'm um, kind of appalled at some of the rates that we get charged. And now we have artificial intelligence to start writing these contracts. My son introduced me to ChatGTP when it became public. Um, ChatGTP, if you don't know about it, is... Um, Elon Musk's investment in artificial intelligence and I wrote this big curriculum that's several hundred pages long over the holidays with the assistance from this so I think what's going to happen is it's going to start making these law firms get more competitive and um, you know these these um, tools are going to really disrupt a lot of industries we're we're seeing it right here in our own and we use it all day long now it's it's better than Google would ever be or any other database. So, so anyhow, here's the, um, the contract, and um, we'll, we'll put this together and send it over to Scott's lawyers. Pretty cool. Um, so I'm real happy. I, I'll, I can keep tuning it, and I can just look at this, and, and um, this is the basis for the contract. So anyhow, pretty cool stuff.